is going on friends today we have 20 minutes to get in a killer chest and triceps workout so we are going to do four movements we're setting the timer we are literally moving our body the entire time taking two seconds to get water if we need it and the name of the game is just doing what you can so we're going to try to do about 12 to 15 reps per movement we're doing incline chest presses if you don't have a bench at home and you want to do this on a ball you can do it on the ball you can do it on the floor heavy as heavy as you can with the chest press then we're moving to the tricep press downs if you do not have a cable machine you're going to use a band elbows locked in core tight all about the triceps then we're moving to wide push-ups and then the last movement is tricep push-ups. It sounds like it's not gonna to be too difficult, but it will be, trust and believe. Okay, so we're gonna set our timer. We're doing 20 minutes and we are going to hit it. Hopefully you're nice and warmed up. And again, if you don't wanna do incline, that's fine. When we're doing incline, you can do a pulse into full or you can just do full range, but you do want to challenge yourself if you get to 12 reps and you can keep going to 15 go to 15 but by the second and third set it's going to be a lot more challenging so just keep that in mind as well blowing that air out as you press it up keeping our core tight you don't want to go too low with these because then you could potentially injure your shoulders And I will be honest in saying that when I do movements, I don't typically count. I just go off of feeling. If I get to 12 to 15 and I can keep going, I will surely keep going. Elbows locked in, blowing that air out as you push down. Now, if you have bands, it's okay to start with your heaviest and then drop down to a lighter one. Woo! Okay. Now, I am going to show you on the bench how you can do it on the bench. We're going to go wide. If you tilt your hands out, you're getting more of that underarm area that we do collect fat. But you can do these on the floor, too. no more than 10 seconds rest and then I'm gonna go for triceps when you're doing your triceps your elbows should be in hands should be right under your chest as you lower here we go can do and that's what we need to focus on at the end of the day numbers are irrelevant in all regards honestly so you just push your body to the max that day and keep it moving all I could do. Barely got 11. It's fine. I'm going to turn on my fan. All right. Triceps. I'm going to turn up my music a little bit. Here we go.
The last few, if you cannot rotate your wrists out, it's fine. Just do what you can. Some days you're gonna be able to rotate, other days you won't be able to do it for the whole set. It's totally fine. Again, patting your hands out, it's gonna get a little bit more of this armpit area. Here we go. Try to touch your chest if you can. Three more. Power it up. 10 seconds or less rest. If you want to challenge yourself, feet up on the bench, hands down on the ground. If not, just keep it tight. Triceps, hands under your chest. Do five more. Woo! I felt one hell of a burn, so I really, it really does not matter if you drop down your knees. You keep it tight. You keep that form on point. Do what is best for you in that moment. And do not think into it anymore. I think we really get down on ourselves too much for not getting as many reps or doing as much weight as we may have done in the past. You challenge your body in that moment. That's all you can do. See, I'm already struggling. That's fine. Change up the angle. You can do that. 
So, you know what? I am gonna keep it on incline because incline hits more shoulders and chest, whereas flat bench doesn't activate the delts as much, meaning shoulders. Okay, here we go. many reps as I can. If you prefer lightening your weight, you can surely do that, but I'm just not going to do that right now. Now, I can't even get this off, but yeah, I think you guys can see me right here for when I'm doing my rope, my band, I should say, my rope band. Okay, here we go. lighter band and whichever angle you want to do for your hands is fine. I can't be, ooh, I stopped the music. Okay, you guys can barely see me, but that's all right. I can't come too far back because then I will be defeating the purpose of doing these. me next time. Just a smidge. Okay. Now push-ups. I am going to stay with the bench for these push-ups because I feel like it's a good angle for my body. Now if the floor is a better angle for you, by all means, triceps. Two 
four. motion is not there so I am dropping to my band here we go Let's keep it tight now here's something else we can do and when you get to the point where the two is not is not doing you well then you grab one handle with both hands Okay, I got both hands. Wrap it out. Burn it out. Lifting heavy is great. However, if you want the lean, muscular, sculpted look, you have to feel burn. If you do not feel burn, it is probably just going to be an overall muscular look, okay? Which is not bad. That's a lot of people's goal. But I know a lot of people that do, you know, DM me and message me, their goals are more aesthetically lean looking. You know what I'm saying? I'm just trying to buy time, okay? And we have a child. So it's got a nice blouse on from her mother's closet. Why don't you do a little twirl for them? Show them the nice blouse. Why did you unbutton your shirt? I didn't. Well, it's unbutton at the top. Oh. All right, time out. Oh, time, time out for the workout. I didn't do anything. All right, I well, didn't it. I, didn't take it I know I didn't say you did, but it's, uh, or maybe I did say you did, but. Maybe it came open on its own. Yeah, I guess. Never know. Yes. No, you have to zip it all the way up. No, it doesn't do that. There's a little open. A peekaboo back. That's what it's called, a peekaboo back. All right, here we go. Can you please move? Because i got to do the set. Hey, what did we talk about? If she doesn't listen at all today, or I should say, if there's one time she does not listen, there will be repercussions. And guess what? I get to go... To an older, I get to go to an older gymnastics team. I'm not going to be in the little kids one. I'm going to be in the older gymnastics. Right, Mom? Right. Today. Right, Mama? That's my first time. Right. See what happens when you rest a little bit longer? All right. No, no, no. Mama needs it. I only have two more minutes. Get okay. back up. I want to do some too. I think that's the No, I cannot. You can do the push ups with me. Okay, mommy. All right. I'll do the push ups. All right, hold on. I gotta do this real quick. Okay, I, I have music on my phone. Oh, okay. Little you can music. You can play that. Okay. What music is it? It's just some music that I hear. All right. Like it's just, they don't talk. They just like do the music. It's like instrumental? Yes, yeah, just instrumental. All right. Sounds and perfect. Gonna, well, when I get like 10, I'm going to hear the, the, um, the music on my phone. All right. Sounds good. Oh, we have quite the tunes for you today, friends. All right. Let's do these push ups. Let's move Let's this out of the way. This will be the final rock. You gotta move. You got to move. Okay, move. Get out now. Thank you. All right. Too much messing around in the gym will not end pretty. All right. Final set of our push-ups. Now. 
Ready? Hi. Uh, I gotta put this barbell up. It's huge. Alright, push ups. Let's go. We're gonna go wide. Hands wide. Okay, ready? Hit it. Good job. Okay, we can drop down to our knees. There you go. Good job. You got it. Oh, just looking at that blouse. All right, triceps. Come on. Let's go. Don't give up. Last round. Ready? Let's get 15. Ready? Hit it. <laughs> 